So it's November 2nd. We're on the Ohio River today. We're gonna to do some catfishing. The first thing we're gonna do is catch some bait and then we're gonna do some anchor fishing and maybe some bumping later on. But we've got some nice weather, overcast 60 degrees. It should be a good day to catch some big fish, so stay tuned. So bait was pretty tough to catch, but we were able to get one pretty good size Asian carp and we got some frozen skipjack that we brought with us. We had planned on doing some anchor fishing around these barges today out on the main river and there's just really not enough current to do that. So we're gonna head up river towards the dam. There should be a little more water moving up that way. And so we'll see you guys up there. All right, so on our way to the dam, we stopped here beside the lock wall. We got some pretty good current. Looks like probably about two and a half mile an hour. So we're gonna make a couple real quick drifts down through here with our bumping rod. I'm just bouncing a two ounce weight off the bottom as we drift backwards with the current uh, with a piece of cut skipjack. So we'll see what happens. We'll give it probably about 30 minutes to see what happens. Here, take over for a minute. So I handed Landon my rod for just a minute while I went and got something to drink. He hooks up with a fish. That's his luck. Not a big one, but first one of the day, we'll take it. Nice little blue. All right, so there's the first one of the day. Landon was lucky enough to catch it while I was messing around on the front of the boat. But not a bad fish. We're going to try to get a bigger one. And that one's on a piece of skipjack. So we'll drop another piece down, see what happens. All right, so there's fish number two. There's obviously some fish hanging out in this little canal we're in, but I'm not sure how much longer we're gonna stay. We've pretty much covered this whole little area right here, and this is all we're catching in this fish this size. So uh, we'll probably go ahead and finish this. Just soak myself. We're gonna go ahead and finish this drift that we're on right now. And after that, we're gonna head up closer to the dam, see what else we can come up with. Just look at it. Just look at it. Yeah, well. What the heck is that? So we're using our trolling motor to hold us in place right here at the hydros. We're just letting the current pull our baits back away from the boat. And uh, normally this is a place where I can catch plenty of five to 10 pound blue cats and occasionally a bigger fish will be hiding in here too, so. I don't think it's very big, but I got him in that current. He feels good. I don't think we're gonna need the net, but I'm not real sure. 
Uh, he's about maybe a little bigger than those other ones. All right, there's a little bit better fish. I'm gonna go ahead and get him back and drop another bait because I think there's probably a ton of these down there waiting on us. Oh, oh Lord, is it big? All right, so Landon has got him one hooked up on his broomstick here. I mean, you, it just got to the bottom, didn't it? Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, jump. Fast. Yeah, he might be a little better. About the same. So that's number four, not a big one, but we're having fun catching fish. And uh, the time, the time of year, and everything. There's no doubt in my mind. There's some big fish ready to eat. We just got a final. Yeah. I don't think he's any bigger than what we've been catching, though. That's number five. If we was in a tournament, we'd have our lemon anyway. But that's a that's a pretty nice quality fish right there. A good looking fish. Nothing wrong with that. And the good thing about using an Asian carp, silver carp for bait, is it always stays on the hook. Let's drop this down again and see if we can do that one more time. Fish. Might be the smallest one yet. So that's all we're gonna have time for today. We had a great day on the river. Nothing too crazy happened, just some average sized blue cats. I think we ended up with six or seven, but it felt great to be back out on the water again. Uh, we haven't done a whole lot of fishing over the past month or so, cause it's just been so dry around here. Our rivers are down to zero current at all, but uh, great time out on the river. We're gonna do it again real soon. I wanna thank you guys for watching. God bless, and we'll see y'all in the next one.